Okay, okay. Sit, don't stop moving. Just sit right there. No more moving. And hands in your bowl. Perfect. Okay, guys. Um, oh, there's our oven. It's done preheating. I have been seeing these like really yummy looking pumpkin twists all over like Facebook and Pinterest and they just look too easy and too good not to try it. So today's Pinterest Friday are these yummy looking pumpkin twists and we'll see if they turn out. How about that? We've got our handy dandy uh, Pillsbury Crescent Rolls which we use for like a million things this time of year. And we've got our pumpkin. Actually this is, I've come to find out, pumpkin pie mix. So it's actually not pumpkin puree, which I don't know if it matters, but that's what I have on hand. And then pumpkin pie spice. Piper has that for us right here. Thank you, Piper. I want to do that. You want to do that? <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> it popped. <laughs> okay, so what we got to do, it says to... I have a little bit of I guess. Porter always likes to eat some of the dough. It's probably really unhealthy. Don't tell anybody that I let my kids eat the dough. So you pretty much just lay down. We lined our cookie sheet and you lay down the dough in like four squares. So you have your like triangles, you know. Yeah, these ones are all falling apart. So I'm just gonna kind of piece them together. You just have like two main triangles that are still together like pieced together like they are when you open it and then you put the other four on top of those. Wait, that's Mama! <gasps> that's a crayon, I think. Okay, Porter, you want to spoon on the pumpkin? Yes. Yeah. So now I still have a whole bunch of pumpkin that I'm gonna have to make something else with, I guess. Okay, then I guess you just put on the other triangles right on top. What? Mama, I'm on the water, Harry. Oh, <laughs> so wait, now I have to put some of that on top of it. Do you know what we're gonna do now, Porter? Put some butter on it. Let's put some butter on it. Get some of this melted butter I have prepared in advance. I'm gonna overload this stuff. Yummy! Yummy! Okay, let me do one and then you can do the other one. All you gotta do is just sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Do like that. Okay, ready? Hold it. Okay, ready? Sprinkle, sprinkle. Good job. Now we've got my handy dandy pizza cutter that my mother-in-law gave me like a couple years ago. I use this thing for everything, people. I use it to cut quesadillas, I use it to cut pancakes, waffles, and now I'm using it to cut pumpkin strips. So we're supposed to cut these into six strips each. I think I'm just gonna do four strips each because, I don't know, they look like really skinny if I did six. Okay, I think we're almost ready to cook it. I'm just gonna see, I almost want to put like some more butter on it or something. But this says to just twist the strips Oh, and then sprinkle with some more pumpkin spice. So we'll sprinkle some more and then we'll bake for eight to 10 minutes. Okay, now while those are cooking, we're gonna make the frosting to go on them when they come out. They have like a, just a simple cream cheese frosting that we're gonna make right now. was like experimenting with the, the frosting, so it looks a little wonky, but I think 
that I kind of like these ones the best. I just went like like straight across. Uh, I did some swirls. I just like spread some on these ones because that was I did a little bit too big of a hole in my in my spout. Anyway, let's see how they taste. I I fear that I'm thinking it's gonna taste like a cinnamon roll, and I don't think it is. So I'm trying to think pumpkin before I taste it, so I'm not like freaking out. You guys want to try it? You ready to eat it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Something like that. Kind of good. Mmm. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad at all. No. Yummy. Uh, maybe good. It's good? Yeah. I think this is a pin win, guys. We have ourselves a pumpkin pin win. Yummy. Mommy. The frosting definitely mommy, makes it though. So you gotta make sure to do the frosting, obviously. Like, I already knew that. Maybe some more pumpkin inside, maybe. but maybe not. It's like subtle pumpkin. Okay. pumpkin Good? Mm -hmm. Good. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you can try out these. They were super easy. They literally probably took me like 15 minutes to make with everything. So if you have kids, it might take a little bit longer. Thanks for watching, though. We'll see you guys um, on Monday. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And let's see if we can get this video 100 likes. How about that? Does that sound okay? Yeah.